something uh, that I need to fix as Arab in Panama happened, but I'm not going back, you know, just... Uh, it's a great weather window, especially when we are around the Guajira Peninsula. Hi, my name is João and I'm sailing on my boat, Winderlust. I got it in Barcelona in July 2020 and been sailing it around down the Spanish coast, onto Gibraltar, then the Canaries, then to the Cape Verde Islands and cross the Atlantic to Martinique. And then I left on a four day solo trip down to Curaçao, where I'm now in the ABCs, the Dutch Caribbean. And I've also stopped here in order to fix the UV band protection of the Genoa, uh, because I just got a squall on the first day leaving Martinique. It was kind of the baptism <laughs> back, on, back on the wind but it's all good and stay updated for this journey What's up everyone? First day of the crossing from Curaçao to Panama. Should be five, six days, I guess six. So now it's Monday. It's already like noon, so I should be arriving there like Saturday morning. What's up people? Uh, yeah, I just left Curaçao. Now I'm leaving it behind. It's already... We are approaching uh, timely the sunset. Day one. I have, it looks like I have some like naval ship from probably from the Netherlands like always close by. I've seen also like the coast guards. Apparently it's Dutch because the, the Netherlands they own the or they control the national defense ministry here in Curaçao as well the foreign affairs and the remainder ministries are under regional control. Anyway, pass by Willemstad, beautiful. Uh, not only in there in loco but also from the sea it also looks really beautiful it's a charming island um, i think i should come back one day <laughs> i have a lot of reasons too because there's so much to see here uh, but beware it's uh, it's expensive huh? i think the best is to rent a car and move around the island otherwise you get trapped into taxis and uh, buzz that are cheap but they, they run very very seldom so um, that's it now as I pass by the the northern uh, point the northernmost point of the island Lourdes Punt how they say it in Dutch now I'm starting to feel more the swell the Caribbean swell that comes from the uh, Antilles uh, the West Indies right Martinique, all those spots, etc. And yeah, but uh, I need to go like this with the waves on the beam for like uh, maybe until tomorrow noon. There will be rain. I'm gonna have rain this night. But I mean, no, no other option. This is a good weather winter to live. Uh, when I was opening the Genoa, something uh, that I need to fix as Arab in Panama happened, but I'm not going back, you know, just. Uh, this is a great weather window, especially when we are around the Guajira Peninsula in uh, Colombia and also the Venezuelan Peninsula. It's usually very, very, very windy and uh, rough sea uh, and wavy, rolly, gusty. So, I mean, I think just ready to go and uh, I'll sort it out. Yeah, what's up? Good morning. Day two. 
winter last year reporting live <laughs> and yeah, in the middle of the Caribbean Sea uh, next to Peninsula de Guajira in Colombia uh, yeah probably now already in Colombian waters but heading to Panama it's gonna take five more days uh, today's Tuesday at least more Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday so five sailing days at least should arrive there Saturday by the end of the day let's see um, yeah smooth sometimes there are some uh, nimbus, as you can see over there doesn't look very good but I mean the sail is rift the the wind is not so hard today so if it if it increases it can be compensated um, yeah so smooth sailing so far so good uh, and no, no problem and that's it here uh, some sometimes you see some boats some uh, cargo ships containers or like uh, cruise liners also um, it's it's immense it's, it's like huge it's vast this sea it never ends it's so big so big but you can always see some life some flying fish uh, which is mind-blowing right yesterday leaving um, Curaçao I could see I'm not sure if it was like very very small whales or like big dolphins but one or the other it was a group like four of them um, at first I was I was even thinking it was a shark because of the dorsal fin but no uh, it was uh, they were either dolphins or uh, whales but yeah there's, there's quite something here uh, but yeah this is this is immense this is really big but obviously because of the Panama Canal you can see some boats coming there going there or coming from there that's for sure okay let's keep sailing and uh, I'll keep you updated day three day four six five <laughs> okay Resistant to anything, no, I'm pimping all whacker. I'm 
much flyer, united, I'm NASA I'm much higher, not a puffer, I'm a passer Not a rusher or a tackler I ain't got a cuffer or a tagger Like I'm a grapher or a wrestler I grind, I should make the cover a thrasher Chillin' with the cover a king Yeah, I'm out My sneakers more cleaner than yours More cleaner, more cleaner than yours I got a mask like a master I'ma take it like a relay The line's on the track You think I'm running on the freeway In a great truck Never get the brakes pumped You think my kicks are on dust Cause they laced up Like I ain't running straight Actually I'm running late You could call me the vice prez I'm your running mate I go from 1 to 8 And 9 to 5 And back to 9 That's why I'm running up this mountain That I have to climb To the summit You did it then I've done it The game's red lights I'ma run it And you ain't gotta guess again Look at all the mess we in Walking like a horse An equestrian pedestrian I'ma bring the session in. Watch it as I do me I'ma keep it all together like I was a shoe tree I think that it suits me Remembering when Letterman was calling Lupe Lupe This new way's groovy But take a second, you need to breathe Give me a minute, I need to breathe Excuse me, man, I can't see Cause you in my way But take a second, you need to breathe Give me a minute, I need to breathe Excuse me, man, I can't see Cause you in my way Just about to arrive in Shelter Bay. The engine is already on for this final stretch. Just approaching now the, the bay. And yeah, actually it's, it's still a few more hours, but yeah, yeah, I'll get there really early in the morning with the sunrise. The sun is setting now, so let's say like 10 more hours. Um, the wind just completely died like five knots of wind so i mean i'm just motor sailing and let's just get that as soon as possible and that's it it's the end of like a seven day solo sailing trip uh, in the caribbean uh, plus five uh, more days uh, leaving martinique then to curaçao passing by los roques and now curaçao passing by aruba uh, straight to panama colon skipped San Blas but I mean you you cannot see it all so you really have to pick uh, in San Blas next time I'm sure it's beautiful but there are a lot of beautiful things on the other side of the the Central America and the Pacific so I mean let's just get straight through the canal and jump on to the Pacific uh, let's do it I'm looking forward, it's gonna be really, really, really cool, okay? And thanks for watching this video, again, it was a beautiful sail, um, seven days. The wind was strong, some strong, sometimes guessing like 30 knots plus, sometimes also down to 15, so it was kind of a wide range of, uh, of wind. 
uh, but always manageable even though most of the time two riffs started with one riff then moved into two riffs and yeah until the end now just uh, like 50 miles 80 miles I'm, I'm turning on the engine as the wind completely died out and yeah just just looking forward to arrive there okay keep sailing stay tuned for the coming videos all right thanks and please subscribe the channel leave your comments drop your like it's like big 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 positive fed feedback and i really appreciate it okay stay safe Thank <laughs> you.